I have spent a significant amount of money to recreate the most expensive G-Shock in the entire world. So today I'm going to share with you my exact custom parts list as well as the prices of each item and why I've chosen them. And stick around to the end because all of my parts have arrived. So we're going to do an unboxing. <laughs> The Mr. G B5000 is the absolute pinnacle of G-Shock design and engineering. Unfortunately for me, this incredible design comes with an enormous price tag of 5,500 Australian dollars. And since that's just a little bit outside my price range, I'm sure you can understand why I decided to build a functionally identical model for a fraction of the price. So let's go through my custom parts list and if you want to get your hands on anything that we discuss there will be links for you in the description below. The very first thing you'll need is a G-Shock and it has to be a GWB5600. Now the one I'm holding here is the one that I would recommend and that is the GWB5600 SL or Sandland. Now the reason I suggest this model in particular is because of this lovely positive display which means it's black letters on a white background. Most of the other GWB 5600s all have that black display with the white text and we do not want that for this particular build. Coming in at 248 Australian dollars, this is the cheapest B5600 with a positive display but if you manage to find cheaper please let everyone know in the comments below. These next three parts all come from the G Refit parts store on AliExpress. At the time of recording, this store is the only manufacturer on AliExpress who have been able to reproduce these custom parts for the Mr. G B5000. The first and most important of these is the lens and pushes, which set me back 89 Australian dollars. The iconic gold lettering on the lens is what makes this watch recognisable and therefore is a must have for this build. The next item that we went with is the golden titanium Mr. G backplate. Now this will replace the silver backplate on your B5600 and technically this is an optional part seeing as you won't necessarily see it under your wrist. However, I was more than happy to pay the 86 Australian dollars that this one cost given it's made of titanium and I would love to have this build looking complete. The final part we need from this seller is the bezel and strap. Now I'm going to give you two options that they have available with different prices. The first option is their original Mr. G replica made of titanium and features the original golden butterfly clasp lock. This one comes in at 499 Australian dollars. The second option for the bezel and strap comes from the same seller, though it was not specifically designed for the Mr. G. Coming in at $89, this steel strap and bezel is compatible with our B5600 module. So my decision given those two options was to go with the $89 steel version, understanding that I would be sacrificing the golden butterfly clasp. However, that was a compromise I was willing to make to save $400. Now guys, as you can see, this is already a really expensive parts list so far and honestly a big risk for me to make this purchase. If you'd like to help support the channel so that I can continue to make videos just like this one, I've just created a Patreon page and I'd really appreciate it if you took just a moment to check it out. The link will be for you in the description below and I'll also leave a link for you on screen at the end of the video. Thank you so much. Now, seeing as we didn't go with the titanium strap and bezel, which would have included golden screws, we're going to need to buy these. So these are a compatible set of golden screws from another seller, which are very affordable and are going to have a massive impact on our final build. The final items on this parts list are tools, which I happen to already have, but in case you don't, here they are. The first tool that you'll need is a watch press to safely remove the lens of your B5600 to insert the new one. Now it does include a bag of default attachments, however we are going to need to purchase a separate bag of optional attachments so that we have the following piece which will allow us to safely remove the screen lens without damaging the delicate solar panel. The final tool which I always recommend to anyone doing a watch repair is this Lubri Joints Gasket Grease. And this stuff is incredibly good value for money because it allows you to ensure that your watch remains waterproof after you've repaired it. 
The total cost of all of the parts that I bought for this build, not including the tools I already owned, was $550.68. Which, by the way, I calculated using my awesome calculator watch, which I'm wearing for Watch of the Week. If you missed the video of the unboxing, check that one out above. Now, just to remind you, the cost of a legitimate Mr. G B5000 is $5,500 Australian dollars, literally 10 times the price of what I paid for the parts for this build. So if I can get this build to work, I am going to be so incredibly satisfied. If you're enjoying the video so far, don't forget to smash that like button because it's now time for the unboxing. I've got a couple of separate packages here. And look at that, that's our golden screws. Awesome. And the main part, we all know what this is going to be. Okay, so let's start with this smaller one just here. What have we got? Maybe this will be the... Oh, yes. All right. So now that must be the little um, speaker sticker that goes on this. Oh, my God. Look at this. Look at that lovely titanium case back with the Mr. G logo. That looks incredible. Let's get this out. Oh, man. I want to have a closer look at this bad boy. Oh, it's already got one of the stickers on there. Oh my, look at this. How nice does that look? I can't wait to get this on. So this is our screen lens. Now check it out. I was like, hang on, there's no, the golden lettering's not there. But actually it looks like it's in two separate pieces. And I imagine this has got to be, oh yeah. So here's our golden pushes. Okay, great some little black screws and the spring bars oh yes look at this so here's our bezel and strap oh that looks incredible look at the finish on that let's open this wow look at that absolutely stunning oh yes very nice very nice now I want to show you something real quick because I was quite scared. So have a look at this screen lens. I was looking for the Mr. G text and I was like, oh my God, did it not include it? But it actually did. It's just tucked behind here. So I'll pop it out so you can have a better look. Here is the gorgeous screen lens that we're going to be installing. And here is the glorious golden Mr. G logo and symbol, which is going to be underlaid behind this. So guys, I am so incredibly excited to get this all assembled. So make sure you are subscribed with the notification bell dinged so you don't miss out when this all comes together. As promised, here's the link to my brand new Patreon page where I've spent some time coming up with some unbelievably fun and cool benefits that you definitely want to check out. I'm leaving you with our watches playlist as well as the unboxing video of this awesome Casio calculator watch. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next review.